morning guys morning. and welcome back to the channel where you join us here on a little hike to the Hollywood sign. This is the view that we showed you yesterday in the pitch black. Well we try to. This is it in the day guys. <laughs> now we have come Much here, better. it's only 10 to 9 so not even too early and there is loads and loads of places to park so oh, it's yeah, super simple isn't it to do. Yeah I think it just says is it it's no parking through the night. So 8 p.m. till 6 a.m. Correct. No parking. Yeah. So after 6 a.m., you're good. You're good to go. But yeah, it was super easy to park. There's lots and lots of spaces. And to be fair, you can touch on Monday morning because there's not many people around, which is great. Um, it's bad because we don't really know where we're going because the idea for me is we just follow people. Yeah. Otherwise, we just get lost. Yeah, I'm not too sure. No. We can look on maps, but we wanted to come here anyway. This is the Lake Hollywood Park. Yeah. As I mentioned yesterday when we're here. And it's a big, nice green area there, full of dogs running around, bit of my vibe this. It's really, really nice actually. I've never been this close to Hollywood sign. Oh. Well, never. hopefully we're going to be even closer. I've never been. Well, the weather today is beautiful. It's like I said, it's 10 to 9 already and it mm -hmm. is super, super warm. So I've got my bear stone. And as you can tell by my glasses, guys, there is going to be a bit of Disney in this video. Yeah. Stay tuned. We are. I'm just wearing these randomly. No. I mean, even though I would, though, to be fair. We are going to the uh, Walt Disney Studios today, which is going to be super exciting. That's at 2 p.m. But yes. until then, yes. we've we'll got a hike to do. We'll talk about that later. But yeah, let's do some Hollywood sign stuff. Yeah, let's go. Let's get some pics. So just a quick look at how quiet it is here this morning. There's literally just what, about 10 people I would say in this whole park. Look at the dog, got shoes on. It's like a dog meet up over there, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, look at that one there. Oh, darling. Oh. Oh. What a great view. I should probably put sun cream on because it's, uh, it's hot. Yeah, we need to put cream on. Yeah. Don't we? Oh, also it as well. The sign actually looks a lot closer in real life than it does on camera. It looks very, very close in real life. Yeah, but it's so close. Isn't this it? Is the closest I've ever been. Yeah. yeah. And we have just parked, just in front of that big van. Oh, we are just making our way down the hill where we've just parked because technically you have to go down to go up. What's the number of the um, it's address? It's the Innsdale Trail. Yeah. It said. Um, I can't remember the actual number that you put in. I presume if you put that in it might come up, I but don't know. It does feel weird though, because you do want to go up. Uh, yeah, we have to walk down this big hill. But Never I'm I'll excited. Up to the sign, we'll see. Oh, we will. <laughs> and today, I'm not the fittest person ever. it's super clear because it does get misty obviously in LA, um, but to actually see it as clear as it is today, it's going to be pretty cool. We've had really good weather um, when we've been in the Hollywood side of LA. Yeah. And we like in the mornings, like, whereas Anaheim, it was dead misty. Yeah every morning like here it's literally blue sky straight well, away that guy said yesterday he said you've definitely come to la on a really good week because this week's weather is supposed to be top tier yeah, like he said this week and next week didn't yeah he? yeah so we, we, we come at a good time yeah apparently we have good morning so just a quick look at some of the beautiful houses around here the very like 70s style up here like 70s la and this is giving me matilda vibes you know the car rolls down the hill and isn't it that's nice too. I like the grey. I can't believe the size of the garages. Isn't it? Some of the houses have like six separate detached garages. Isn't it insane? Yeah. That's stunning as well, isn't it? That's like something made from The Sims. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> wow. I'd like to know how much these things cost. Especially when you've got a view of the Hollywood sign as well. Be careful of the rattlesnakes, Luz. Look at that. Beautiful. So here we are on Innsdale Drive. This is the way. Now, from what I can remember, you follow it down. Because there's a left and a down. I think you go down. That's. Yeah. I think so. Because the video when I watched, she said, you, you think to yourself, I need to go up. But you have to follow it down and it eventually starts going round. Right, okay, well I'm up for walking downwards, not up. I'll tell you what, if we 
<laughs> I'll let you know which way to go see. If we make a mistake, you don't. Lots of fruit stands around here as well, isn't there, Luz? You know what? There's people there. Yeah. Let's just follow them. I'm the king of the world! We've actually walked really far. We parked over there. Luz, I'm proud of you. I've done well on that so far. You've done well so far. Yeah. This is what I love being out in the sun. There's cacti to my left, and the Hollywood sign just there. Okay. She loves the pictures, bless her. Guys, we found some animal prints. These look big, don't they? Do you reckon it could be a bear? It's a gorilla. <laughs> Godzilla. Godzilla. Could be a T Rex. Who knows at this point? So off the trail, you do come to a junction here and we think we're going to go left. Just because it looks like the more obvious one because no vehicles are supposed to go through there. And we always say stay left, don't we? Stay left. So we've, we've got to keep true to our word. This is the one that makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, it just says no vehicles up this way. Mm -hmm. So that must mean pedestrians are allowed. This is crazy that these are people's houses here. That is crazy. Look at this. Now it's only actually taken us about I'd say about 25 minutes to get to this point from the car. Would you say so? Uh, it doesn't seem it's long. It's half nine now. What time did we? I feel like we've been here an hour, right? In total? Yeah, we're and having that's... pictures and stuff. I think we might have parked up at about half eight. Yeah. Or eight thirty something. And do you know what though? It is a gradual climb, so don't be worried about being out of breath or knackered. Don't get me wrong, you are going to be sweaty. Oh look, hey. that's a good sign. But it is going to yeah, be a gradual right climb, way. which Lucy's very happy about. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just out of breath at the minute because I'm talking to you guys. So it's all your fault. <laughs> I'm talking to you and trying to walk uphill. <laughs> I knew we were going the right way. <sighs> Professionals hikers here. I love how it says, no hiking allowed to the Hollywood sign. However, there's a sign saying Hollywood sign hiking this way. <laughs> And there's other people, so we're following them. I think she looked like um, a local. Yeah. God, she's well ahead of us now. Oh yeah, she's all the way over there. Oh God, she's showing us up. Oh, it's definitely this way, because you come from this barrier. I remember seeing this in um, Wizards and Waltz, I think. I mean, maybe Kaz's, can't remember. I've watched that many LA vlogs. So we got lost, and then we saw a little like trail going up, and Steve's just been up. He took one for the team. I've seen, I've seen lizards. Lizards? Yeah, it's very, very slippy. At least you didn't see um, snakes. Well, I'm not down yet. No, but um, it wasn't the way, guys. It went up, I said it was a good picture point, but we don't think it's the trail. Because we've just carried on down there and it just takes you to some more houses and then it started going down. So to we're be thinking, honest with you. I don't think that's the way, but might continue to go down there and just see. <laughs> Don't fall! <laughs> or do, it's on camera. Well, I need to take my shoes off for sure because I've got a lot of dust in them. Oh. Even if that was the way, there's no way you'd have gone up. No. I don't think I could. Right. 
So guys, when I mentioned that the trail takes you to some houses and then down a hill, this is where I meant. However... I remember this bit because there's a gate here that you, you can't see it. It looks like it's attached to the house, but it's actually not. It's the way to the trail. Oh, guys. I remember seeing this in the video. So, yeah, we're not lost. We just took a little detour so Steve could get a selfie. That's all it was. Yeah. I'm pretty Ooh. sure I saw it in um, Wizards and Walt. Did you? Yeah. And that's what I, when I saw it, then I thought, oh, yeah, I remember that. Dangerous animals may be present, including mountain lions and rattlesnakes. Ah, bang them out, me. Maybe it was a mountain lion print that we saw. I get one in a headlock. Okay, right. We're back already. on track, guys. We're back Let's on. Let's carry on. There we go. Oh, there we go. This looks more like it. Right. Let's go. Whew. You made me climb a bloody mountain I for nothing. I did not make you do anything. That was by choice. I could have been bitten by a snake. Wow, look at downtown LA. Oh, wow. We'll look at that view in a sec. Wow. There she is. We're getting closer. Another way, guys. We've got this. Downtown LA. Can you even make that out on camera? I don't know because it's quite misty over there, the smog. But it's there. And yeah, I'm still out of breath. <laughs> Whew, I need some water. Keep hydrated, guys. So there's a more full overview of the view that you can see, the other side to the Hollywood sign. Again, like I said, it is misty, like the smog, but I think you can make it out. Yeah, you've got downtown LA there. Yeah, so the left and then. On a clear day down there, you will get to see like Santa Monica. All oh, right, we're like right yeah. over there. I can also see a random, I'm not gonna be able to zoom in guys, cause it won't zoom in that far, but I can see a water tower. So I wonder what that is. Could be Warner Brothers. It might, like, look at this. There's a pool on the, on the roof there and that is your yeah, view. Yeah, down there, yeah. Hollywood sign is your view. Yeah, it's sick. So if I pan round. Oh, there's a helicopter coming. Maybe they're on a tour. They bring you close to the Hollywood sign, don't yeah, they? they? do. And then, guys, we're here. Well, we've come to a point anyway. Yeah. So apparently, I just was listening to a tour guide then. She said to get over the... The, obviously the sign you've got to go all the way down and that's more like a three hour tour she said yeah. but they usually leave a lot earlier because like you said it is it gets hot yeah gets hot. i didn't know it took that long maybe from like start to finish obviously from this point it wouldn't be two hours from now no they say from where we parked to here is about there and back like 90 minutes yeah which is not too bad at all i can actually see people behind the hollywood sign right at the top can you see yeah good on him i congratulate them because i'd like to well. I'd like to do that, but like I said, we, have to go, we do have to go to uh, the Walt Disney Studios. Yeah. I say have to, like it's a bad thing, of no, course. No, we have got other stuff planned in. If we had longer air, it could yeah. have been a thing we could have done, or we could have got up early, but I didn't realise how long, like we didn't know it would take that long, to no. be fair. But it's stunning. And we didn't get in bed till, well, I went to sleep about 1am, yeah. so I didn't fancy having like no sleep and no. then do a hike. Do you know what I mean? But do you know what? This but is still this the closest a, we've ever been. Yeah, this is a stunning view, guys. Like, wow, I can't believe, like we're close. We're pretty close. Yeah. Don't know if it's looking close on camera, but we are. Wow. And it wouldn't, it doesn't look like it would take 90 minutes to get from here to the top. No, but I think but she said you have turn to, around. Yeah, there's this like trail here, and apparently you go down. Look, and you follow it all the way down yeah, there. Yeah, you must go all the way down there and then back up. Back up. Wow. There's not like a straighter route, is there? No. But wow, this is absolutely stunning. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, and I'm not sweating, you know, not as much. Bit on my nose because my sunglasses, but that's it. I am. You are because you did that little hike, an I extra climbed, little hike. I climbed bloody Everest. You see me? <laughs> wow. Right, let's get some pictures. Spectacular.
and it's literally just here. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. This bit. How? Just jump. <laughs> Did you see your leg at the bottom? It snapped your ankle. I know, exactly. I don't want to do that. So we are just making our way down now from the Hollywood sign now. We're going to go and get mm -hmm. some breakfast because again, like yesterday, we've not eaten. But we keep going doing stuff and then thinking, oh yeah, I'm, I'm a bit hungry actually. But this time it's early. It's not even half past 10 yet. So it's still breakfast time. Yesterday was like lunch time. Yeah, we're thinking of going to go and try and find a diner of some sort. Now we've got these Johnny Rockets, Mel's Diner. You've got a diner on the list, haven't you? Yeah, it's, it's Pan American. Pa Pan's diner. American Diner. Now I've seen videos on it. It's very like old school diner. Yeah. But it is in the opposite direction of Burbank. Oh, so, is it? Yeah, like right. Burbank's up. Uh, Inglewood is down, so it's like I think it's oh, probably right, about okay. 45 minutes away. Right, and so maybe not, but we could um, with yeah. LA traffic as well. So um, we'll have a little look when we get back to car, see what diners are nearby. So we'd like to sit down and eat yeah. something like a big meal. Do you know what I mean? And, Rather than just get Starbucks like we keep doing. And I also want um, a traditional American diner milkshake. Also, guys, breaking news: I've just petted a dog. It was on his little hike, oh. And he was old, like yeah. you could tell he was like, oh, we gotta do this again. Yeah, the, the other one was like dead happy, weren't it? It was just like, yeah, I'm ready to do this. And that one was just like, help. <laughs> and um, she let me pet him and she said he loves being petted. So I've, I've made his day, haven't I? Well, I'm not sure about that. He was yeah. hoping you'd take him back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy to do that, right? Should we go get him? So we have just come to BB's now. Uh, it's a breakfast diner. The logo, well, the slogan, sorry, should I say, it says breakfast is everything. Breakfast is everything. Now, so this was literally a 14 minute drive from where we parked for the Hollywood sign. It's in Burbank, so it's convenient for when we do the Walt Disney Studios tour. Yeah, so we looked at Mel's Drive In, Mel's Diner, and yep. also Johnny Rockets, but they were, sh they were, we found some, but they were in the Universal yes. City Studios bit, so we would have had to pay. Parking. parking at Universal and you guys probably know it's going to be expensive yeah. so it was like right scrap that idea let's and I just googled best breakfast in Burbank and BB's and this came was, up yeah this was one of them that came up and it looked good the menu didn't yeah, it it looks Look, really good yeah it looked like they've got a lot of like variety and stuff to choose from so what was the rating 4.5 or something yeah something like that stars yeah, yeah. and I think and reviews. Johnny Rockets was four and Mel's was two so oh we don't want that it said Mel's Diner, not Mel's Driving. Yeah. I don't know if it's a different thing. I think it is. I think Mel's Driving's okay. different, but there weren't any that Mel's Driving weren't no. anywhere nearby. It was a Mel's Diner, so I don't know if that was just a random one. But I like to try BBs. Yeah, it's and, just um, in this random Lakeside Centre. It's parking called. Lot. This, by the way, wow. So we've hired a new car, guys. Um, we got rid of Elvis. <laughs> Elvis, yeah. <laughs> Um, no. no, so I checked Pan's restaurant as well, the American Diner, and that was a 45 minute uh, drive oh, away. So, yes. And it was completely the other end of town. So the, we just didn't want to risk having to be stuck in traffic and panicking about not being able to make the tour. So yeah. and we, we just thought, thought. If we have time after breakfast, we can just explore Burbank and like see to. what there is around here. Because um, the time is 11, yeah. so our tour's at 2. So we've got a bit of time yeah. so have that breakfast and have a little mooch. Let's have some breakfast. Breakfast is everything. Dun, dun, dun. So we can't film the menu guys because it's actually mine is like a QR code. So I'm gonna put I've just done a screen recording, so one side of the screen in a sec will be the menu, so we'll go through it. So it's a massive menu in it. Mm -hmm. There's so much. So we've got pancakes, French toast, waffles and crepes. And we've got so much variety on there and so many different ones as well, isn't there? Yeah, there's loads. There's loads. Then we've got the good stuff, which looks like it's like combos. So you pick like stuff and it comes like bacon, eggs, you know, like massive plates. Good morning. So you've got quesadillas in there and burritos, sandwiches. Then you've got eggs exactly the way you want it. Omelette, scrambled or frittata. And then it's got like more of a lunch menu then. So sandwiches, burgers and wraps, salads, and then you can order sides. You can get a side of scoop of tuna if you want. Fries, obviously stuff like that. Bagels, toast, side of rice. Oof. And then your drinks. And we've gone and for. we've gone for some really good drinks, guys. Strawberry lemonade. I'm just going to put the QR code there. So yeah, if anybody does. Scan the QR as well. If you want to look at. Because I don't know how fast I've just scrolled through the menu on the screen. So I don't know if you can pause the video or just scan that QR. Yeah. And you'll get the menu. But it's a good menu. It's a great menu. I think I've decided. Okay, 
I went for crunchy cornflake French toast. So it's French toast rolled in crunch nut cornflakes and almonds apparently. Look at this. Side. If you could <laughs> smell this, it smells ridiculous. I think it comes with a bit of syrup as well. Pour it on. And one of my favourite all-time breakfast items, breakfast potatoes. Are they good breakfast potatoes though? They're salty as well. Oh. I'll try it without the sauce. Okay, and then and then get some sauce on it. Look at the size of them. Hey! The powder. Get it in. Whoa. They smell ridiculously good. Is it nice then or what? <laughs> yeah. Needs that sauce on it. Put it on it. It's a bit not Quag dry, it. but. Quag it. Mm. I might only pour a little bit because I don't like. You don't want to drown it. Wow. Is that better? Better with the syrup, yeah. Yeah. These are really nice though. Like, no like overpowering flavour, it's just like original French toast. I'm oh, good, I'm good. And then that just adds a bit of crunch to it. And there, 10 out of 10. Sweet. Mm -hmm. I don't like. I do. So I didn't go for anything sweet because I know Lucy was never going to finish all this. So why get two sweet things where I can just get something like this? I mean, then, I've already given one on his plate as well, so you can try it for you guys. Exactly. So I went for the early bird burrito, which has got like bacon, sausage, um, eggs. It's got like a garlic thing in there, which the garlic smells really strong. And it's quite a chunky, chunky burrito. So That's a really good burrito, that. <laughs> smells good. Because I normally get burritos. You took a lot of stuff out, didn't you? Like, I think it had pico, salsa, and guacamole Tomatoes. on the side, didn't it? And you got everything taken out. That's amazing. I love the garlic in it. It's a nice little change. I like it. Mm. Nice. Really good. You won't like it. It's got bacon in it. No, I won't like that. But that is a really good burrito. I love the garlic touch. Do you want to try a, a bit of French toast while the camera's sure. rolling? Shall I dip it in the uh, syrup? Oh, yeah. I'll dip it. Mmm. I like the crunch. Mmm. Nice, isn't it? It's just like an original taste. Yeah, but, but I, I like the crunch. That's really, really nice. Mm. It's different, isn't it? Yeah. I like that. It's not too crunchy, not too soft. Like, no. it's just right in it together. It's very, very nice, that. Mm. Very nice. Go on. Do you want me to? Yeah. They're so good. Oh yeah, they're good. That's so good. They taste like proper potato chips, you know, mm. like you put in like a deep fat fryer. Yeah, they do. Mm. Hi, yeah, so good. Doing? Really good. Mm -hmm. So this is the bill, guys. Came to 56.75 and then 5.82 tax. We're still going to need to add a tip on, but it comes to 62.57 without tip. Then we'll add the tip on. Not too bad, right? I mean, my side of home fried potatoes were like $7. Oh, really? But they were good. Oh, they were great. They were great. No, the food was great. Like, yeah. I'm, glad, I'm glad we finally got to sit there. I mean, this is like a Starbucks, like you said. Yeah. There's yeah. Somebody behind's got green pancakes. Green? I wonder what they are. Oh, alien Some ones. Dr. Zeus thing going on here, green eggs and ham. And I thought aliens. Oh, yeah. You went for Dr. Zeus, I went for aliens. No, they look good. No, food was great. I liked it. Yeah, it was really good, actually. So, yeah, let's pay and get out of here. Let's do it. Guys, we've arrived. There's little Mickey things on the railings. Look. Gate 2, that says it down there. <gasps> it's the animation building, look. See that? It's also from Mickey's hat. So guys, we are finally at the Walt Disney Studios here in Burbank. What the hell? We've got our badges. We've got our security passes. So to get in all we did was show us, show us our ID. That was it, it was dead quick. Yeah, I think um, he asked for our names. Our yep. names are on like a little, like I guess, computer screen that he had. Yep. He verified that we have actually got it all booked, that we weren't just coming in. And, um, and you, do, in. you do come in on the Buena Vista entrance. So we made the mistake, we went to the wrong one where the like the water tank is. It's yes. the Buena Vista entrance. Yeah, they just at. directed us yeah. to this one. But the email that I got from D23 said, the other one didn't yes, so did. a bit of confusion but we're good oh it's super easy to, to navigate around it's oh, yeah. really simple but yeah, yeah, yeah. we're on disney property oh, what guys, the hell what? this is this is where it happens this is where the magic happens there are all the different stages yeah. over there where stage they film four stuff. stage two stage one 
So we're going to go and head over towards where the D23 sign is and we'll see what we can film. Of course, yep. we don't know what we can film here in this tour. No, I literally have no idea. Like, no. I don't think we'll be able to film much, but like the Warner Brothers one, it might be where you can yep. film little bits and they just say if you can film yep. or not. So we'll just see. So. We can, you can get pictures. Yeah, that's good. So if not, you might just be seeing loads of pictures at this point. But if we can put our live on, turn them into a little video so add into the vlog isn't this surreal we've seen this on shows on disney plus and and to actually be here is surreal so like lucy said those are the stages there yeah we passed the animation building as we came in i showed you guys and then wow. yeah we just this head is, over here this is weird isn't it so i think our tour was two till half four i yeah. think it said that's how long it takes and to do this tour, I became a free member of D23 because I saw that they were doing tours because this isn't your usual... No, you don't. You can't you, normally you can't, do this. No, you can't just go and do this usually. Um, but they're having like a special kind of event and I think it was for a few months and it just so happened one of the days that we were in LA was one of the days that they were doing the tour so we were like, get on that. So yeah, it was free to get a D23 membership. Let me just show the... Um so it's under my name and then I can bring one guest with me, it said. So count yourself lucky, Stephen, that I picked you. I know, right. Well, who else are you going to go with? Could have picked anyone. <laughs> Could have asked Kim, do you know what I mean? Yeah, so if you are coming on this tour, if you do get the chance to do it, you just follow these D23 signs just over here. Yeah, they said just meet at the D23 sign. So looks like we're here. There's a random Disney cat here. There is no video in on this tour. Of course, we could take pictures and stuff outside here. The toilets are just down there. And the store is there. We get 30 minutes at the end of the tour to shop in the store. So that's going to be exciting, isn't it? Yeah, well, that's when we go in if we can film inside yeah. the store, maybe. I don't know if you're allowed. It's crazy to be here, isn't it? So weird being here. I haven't seen that much yet. <laughs> We're just waiting for our tour now. He's coming in the next two minutes or so. So, guys, I am allowed to film there. I just spoke to a cast member. Can There's we just... so much stuff. This is incredible. So this is 50. So all the stuff in here, we believe you just spoke to the cast member, she said it is exclusive to this store. You can only get it here because it's the employer yeah. bit that we're in of in the studio store in the employee bit. And of course, me and Luz have picked up this. We have picked up <laughs> Of course, this. I've picked this up, guys. Have you seen that? So that was about $45. And this cup... It's quite expensive, but... ...was um, 16 so very cheap. This actually reminds me of my family museum one that I unfortunately smashed. Yeah. But we've replaced it. Now. I also was tempted, but I've bought two caps this trip, and I've already got a black one, which is the Ralph one that you guys saw me buy in Florida. So I don't need another black one. Plus, it's 25 so I thought... Yeah. I'll just get the one item, so I've just got the cup. So they also have this exclusive jacket as well, so if you look on the arm, see if you can make that out, Moose. Oh, wow. Yeah, how nice is that? Yeah, that's really nice. I didn't realise it's oh, so no. subtle. I think that's 96.50, so it's quite expensive. But they also have like a little clearance section that's filled with uh, corksicles. So these corksicles... Yeah, it's going to be very bat like this. $33 for that. I'm not going to lie, I was tempted. Wow, but yeah. I would rather have bought the cup instead of this because I think you can pick this up anywhere. Yeah, and you'll use the cup more than yeah. this, to be fair. Yeah. But they've, they've got, got loads Yeah, they've got an Aladdin one, haven't they? Where is. Oh, that is here. Yeah, again, that's $33. That's on a clearance section. They've got some incredible things. They've also got another jacket here. This is $86.50. Love that. I love the logo this. on that. It's very. Uh, it feels like a shell jacket. Right, okay. Yeah. Yeah, they've got all sorts. It says new arrivals on these as well. That's why I was more tempted as well, you know, to buy this. Yeah. So it's obviously new. So I do like this. Yeah. Oh, look at these as well. Not that we need a notebook of any sort, but oh, they feel so good. Oh wow. They feel amazing. Love that one. Twenty six ninety five. I want everything. I want quite a lot of this store to be fair. And um, not the employee bit, but this is also another store which just sells you general Disney stuff. But we're in the employer section because yeah. this is this way is... more interesting. <laughs> Look at this as well. And more exclusive stuff. That's really, really nice as well. I really like that. That'll cost you forty-two ninety-five. Not bad. That isn't bad actually. This um, top as well. I really, really like. However, they only had medium and extra, extra, extra large. So, so not my size, otherwise I probably, I might have got that, you know, instead of the pot. And also another cap, guys. 
But again, I don't need another cap. Another. Oh, wow. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? How wow. nice is that? This feels expensive. I'm going to tell you how much it Let's cost. see how much. Only $79? Mm. That's really cheap. And of course, guys, it would be rude to not pick up this print. Yes, getting... there's loads behind her. Of course we pick that up. So, price. Does it say on it? I think it's about... How much did you, you just buy it, haven't you? Mm. And they've got matching cups, glasses. Oh, that's a jigsaw just to buy. Oh, I thought it was a cup. No, that's a jigsaw, that one. Oh, right. $25 for that. Oh, yeah. yeah so. Okay, that's cool. And look at this. This is ladies, I'm assuming. I did pick it up. I was yeah, like, it is. I like that, but it's women's. So, unfortunately, I cannot buy that. However, they do have an exclusive spirit jersey. Now, I've never seen this before. And I did speak to the lady. She did say everything in here is usually exclusive. But How that, much? That's amazing. 65 So, same price. Yeah, but I've not seen that before. I think it is because... It's got the water yeah, tower, no. which is no longer a water tower, on it. Yeah. It's got to be exclusive. Only got the free yeah. legs when it's got, um, how many has it got in total? So, six? so originally they were going to put four, but Roy requested, put it in the telegraph and was like, it needs to have six because it looks <laughs> aesthetically pleasing. Uh, and that was his exact words, so. This is also cute. That is also really, really nice. Yeah. Guessing nothing on the back, no. Just some nice pictures of Walt and uh, Julie Andrews in the back. And of course, Aww. Walt there as well. This store is amazing, I want everything. So originally when I came in here, I thought that we could buy these, but unfortunately we can't. But they are incredible. This is it's very similar to the piece we've got in um, our bedroom. So this is Rebecca, this is our tour guide. So she does this for a living. Yes. She just walks <laughs> around these and walks off this every amazing. single day. I am so, so jealous, but she's been amazing. And yeah. she's they, were, they were wonderful. I loved the reactions. Were uh. oh, like, it just gave me goosebumps when we walked into Walt's office. It was amazing. Like, yeah, it was one of the best tour, like, yeah. best tours we've ever done, wasn't it? 100%, 100%. But if you are going to do this tour and you do get Rebecca, you are very, very lucky. She's amazing. Ooh. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, we have just come out of the studios tour. Amazing. I don't know what else to say. No, it was incredible. It like, was incredible. Walt was actually here. Yeah. And like we've touched off Walt touch, we were like walked in his footsteps. Like yeah. Like it was it's so surreal to see it in real yeah. life. Because we see it a lot on like Disney Plus and things like that. Yeah. But it, it is so surreal to see it in real life. See that uh, Dolpy and Mickey Drive and to see oh. that sign in real life. Yeah. Which, by the way, is a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, I think ours is like bigger than it. So, <laughs> we have it on. here's uh, a fact for you. That is not the correct way of where those things are. So, Mickey Drive and Dolpy Avenue, that is the correct way. But, like, in and Paint and stuff like that They're is not... They're actually all facing the wrong way, aren't they? Yeah. Um, I don't Since know the reason for that is, but it is kind of... It's become this kind of... Um, what would you call I it? I think they made it for a film. Yeah. And then... The people it was in for like two seconds, two seconds of this said film and then they put it there but obviously it isn't well, they made it they just made it for the film so they yeah. didn't matter what like direction there was a pointing in and they can't move them so it that doesn't actually make sense there but it's and sick. it's become some sort of artifact that obviously yeah. just lives in it's been here for decades and decades. yeah it's been there years and years hasn't it so that was so, amazing to see and to be in walt's office that was his very office like, was a lot bigger than i thought as well he had yeah. like a suite didn't he yeah he had a working office and a normal had Normal the music one. playing, but you saw the yeah. Sherman Brothers piano and mm -hmm. wow, and also oh, the piano, which yeah. I didn't think we, I, in fact, I didn't know we was going to get this. We got pins, we got little gifts, we got three pins, guys. This might be a spoiler alert if you come in doing it. So, I will give but, you a close up of these, yeah, we'll do a little close up, but these are amazing when when obviously rebecca gave us these i was like no and she was like guys i've got way. a little surprise and she gave us that one didn't she at yeah. first the small one then she was like that's not all i've got more and we were like whoa i didn't expect anything yeah to get these you know yeah. and you can only get these here as well so it's very exclusive yes a bit like the you know the merch you can buy from the the and store it's just like the tour the tour is exclusive to be fair because you have to be like a member don't yeah. you so the general public can't just come oh amazing we saw some incredible things like you said we saw how everything works and because it's a working studio so yeah. like people are just walking around you and like you said if you see any celebs like just pretend they're not there like yeah. last week it's... rebecca saw uh, steven spielberg so you know oh. what's that about like, that's insane like amazing amazing so we saw some amazing pictures of walt of course 
would have shown you all this uh, in like obviously this picture timeline thing. Yeah. You know what? If you do get the opportunity to do this, 100% do it because it's amazing, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> I'm boring you. Yeah? She's yeah. hungry, bless her. No, I'm hungry and I'm tired because we've been like, we haven't sat down. Like, my feet are like, yeah. really? Like, my knees are like, just want to bend. Well, just need to like. <laughs> it's 20 past five and we got here at what, half past one? So, yes. we spent a lot, I mean, a good amount of time here, which was so worth it. It was nice to not even have to film it, it was nice to just kind of walk around with just us and just take a few pictures and enjoy. Yeah, we were allowed to take pictures on most of the yeah. tour. There was just doors that said like, see the door that said Marvel on it, we couldn't take a picture yeah. of that. There was some stuff like inside different like mm -hmm. bits that she was like, you cannot film this, but the rest of it, like the majority, yeah. like, let's like, say like 97% of the tour you could take pictures yeah. in, and which she, is really good. Yeah, she made it clear, like she would tell you just before you went, yeah. like, just let you know you can't do this and you can't do that, so it's very clear what you kind of can't yeah. do. Yeah, and another shout out to Rebecca because she was an amazing oh, tour. Guys, she was really, really good. You know what? The whole group. Like, yeah, we had a really good group. Yeah, like, everyone was really nice. We've, we've, we've just, we've made friends with everyone, haven't yeah. we? Like, so as soon as me and Rob saw each other, it was like, bang, we, we were, we were, we're off already. You know, because it's everybody's very similar. We all have a lot of similarities, and we yeah. all love the same thing. So yeah, the group you, was amazing. And we're all having pictures of each other. Yeah. Like, like it's I turned so around, funny. and Lucy's having a picture. And I went, Are you full of them? I was like, No, I'm just having a picture of my new mates. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, get out. You're not invited. Get uh, out. It was amazing. Reason. Um oh. but no we are done now we are about to leave the park on before they do actually kick us off so don't know where we're gonna go what we're gonna do we'll just sit in the car and have a little look yeah. what's around here but i could do with some food i think yeah for sure um because we've not eaten since that no. french toast i know I, I, it was massive but i could do with some sort of food yeah yeah and then we'll just decide what we do next Fantastic. after that but i mean but, amazing, amazing if you thing. can do it guys do it. do it honestly what was it disney insider yeah. you can do through or d23 yeah. and you you have to, you do have to pay for d23 memberships but i found a free one so i just went on that so if you can yeah go for it that way and just see if there's any dates if you're out here it's, soon. it's definitely summer on anybody loves disney your list this is something you have 100 percent. you have to do i would love obviously to do it again obviously it just depends on if the yeah. dates work with when we're next year yeah um but honestly it was surreal oh. surreal yeah, we could go on it about it for ages, and I don't want to like, I don't want to um, ruin it yeah. for anyone who's going to do the tour. So I don't want to tell you too much, but honestly, you know what, best, best day ever. A few moments later. So for the first time, we've decided to try out raising canes. Now I've seen loads of people going. They all say it's really, really good. My guess is it's very similar to slim chickens. This is what I'm thinking. Like I've looked at the menu and it looks like slim chicken. Yeah. And you love a slim chicken, so. Me and the lads love a You're slim chicken. You're always chickens. at slim chickens. Yeah. Whenever you go to Trafford, I'm always like, I know he's going to get yeah, eating yeah, yeah. at slim chickens. I just know. But so it's let's good see food. what the American, but is slim chickens American? Anyway, this looks very similar. Yeah. yeah. Chicken, chips, what, what can go wrong really? Do you Listen, know what I mean? I love a chicken and chips, mate. I had a whole chicken last night, so. Oh, yeah, you did. I'm not adding chicken strips this chip yet. No, neither have I. So it might be quite nice. Um, I just looked and it looked quite cheap on the menu yeah. as well. It does look good. Yeah, like you can get combos and stuff at like, well, cheap. For like $12, 10, 12 or something. $12, $13, yeah. yeah, yeah. And you get a lot, it looks like. Well, so. let's go and head on and try it for the very first time. Yeah. Raising cane. In we go. Okay guys, so that was the quickest service service ever known to man. It took from me ordering it took ten seconds to Literally, come. he went, What can I get you? This all of Lucy. We we're like, oh. I'm like uh, yeah, I think that's me. So they obviously made the chicken, because obviously a lot of people probably come for combos. It's probably already made and they're just throwing it in a basket. Yeah, but sure. If you want somewhere quick, guys, this Raising is the games. place to come. So it is basically, it looks like some chickens, doesn't it? I you agree. get the, the garlic bread. Um, so basically I went for the three finger combo. So three chicken strips, it comes with crinkle fries and then a garlic toast. Yeah. And this is apparently the famous sauce from yeah. here. It's raising cane sauce, so give and it a I try. I don't really do sauce that looks this colour. Go for it. Looks like the Nando's mayo, doesn't oh, it? Colour. I love the Nando's mayo. And as you can tell guys, we are sat in the sun because the weather this evening is beautiful. It's so I don't so know what hot. This is. Oh brand new Hummer there. Hello Hummer. Look at it lift up then. Uh, excuse me. Sorry. Food review. Um that sauce is alright to be fair. Oh sorry, I got a lemonade as well. Uh, mine came to 12.34. Nice. Cheap. Is it good? Yeah, well, the, the sauce is quite nice. I mean, I'm guessing the chicken will be nice. Right, okay, it's really hot. Right, be careful. But it's good, right? Good piece of chicken, that, to be honest with you, yeah. It's simple, isn't it? Yeah. Like, 
It does, it literally is just slim chickens. And I went for the Kaniac combo. So it basically comes with six chicken strips. We have the regular fries, the garlic bread, the coleslaw, which, yeah, ain't nobody got time for that. Put I'll it over there. It if you get me a fork. And um, the, obviously the garlic toast, so. So yours is like double what I got, basically, innit? Yeah, and this was a large, so it came to $20, which I think is pretty what decent. What drink did you get? I got Coke, classic full fat Coke. Oh, nice. Is it free refills for that? As far as I'm aware, yeah. So I think my lemonade isn't, because it was behind the bar, but we could always refill yours. Wow. I like that. What do you think it's like, the sauce? Because I don't know. It tastes like a, like a peppered gravy. It's definitely peppered yes, for sure. Yes, gravy like, because I do quite like it. That sauce, is, that sauce is better than like slim chicken sauces. Is it? 100%. I've not been slim chickens for so long. The chicken is very, it's very fresh, very juicy, very warm, so you can tell it's fresh. Um, garlic toast, let's give it a try. It's not garlic. Oh, it's not? Oh, it's like a toasted bun. Oh, right, so but maybe it isn't garlic bread. It's like a sweet glaze on it, it's really nice though. Okay. And your fries, how are your fries? Nice. Standard crinkle chips, can't go wrong. Bit of salt on it as well. I you know just what? can't get over how quick it was. I like this. Yeah, me too. They also do merch, guys. They also do merch? Yeah, there was a website, it said, and you can go and get merch on there. Mm. Caps, t-shirts, all sorts. That's amazing. Mmm. Mm. I like. I'll let you know what I think of mine afterwards. So we've just finished at, what's it called? Raising, Raising Cane's, Cane's. Which is just behind us. You know what? I'm going to be dreaming about that Raising cane sauce. That was amazing. I ate like two pieces of Lucy's chicken as well. If you like chicken and fries, amazing. then it's really, it is really, really good. The service alone, if you yeah. want something fast, like that was, fast. that was uh, the Cheap. fastest thing I've ever, that like, the fastest service I've ever had. Like that's, in fact, our service just behind you, Lucy. <laughs> um, <laughs> that service is exactly how fast food, fast food service that's should be. That's what I was thinking about when I was sat there eating it. I thought, yeah. This is what fast food is. Yeah, like it's they've so got quick. it. They've got it down to a tea. And to be fair, I think they do only serve chicken. chicken and chips, so it's easy. Whereas like Mackies and stuff have a lot of different I know, options, I know. don't they? So we've got to give them that. But but it was great. It was great. Yeah. So in a true Stephen style, you know, we'll probably want a dessert right now. So so I turned on my. I literally was sat this on and went. There's a donut place over there. And it's called Donut Prince, and the motto on the window is, "Do not get divorced, get a donut." So it looks like a proper, like family run, old school, traditional donut place. So I thought, you know, while it's over the road, I'm trying to try it out. I'll see how good it is. Anyway, oh, it's yeah, crap. Don't it's get crap. a divorce, mm. get a donut. Right, so. Let's try it. Dining with Steve, coming back at you. I was going to say in a few minutes. Yeah. It'll be the next clip for you guys. So that donut place was everything I actually thought it was going to be. It was very like old school, traditional donut place ran by a small family. And there's loads of like pictures inside of like where they met like Kobe Bryant. He's been down here. $2.70. That's what that cost. And the selection there looks incredible. This is a chocolate topping with a custard cream inside. So very much like your Boston cream. Look at that. Exactly like a Boston cream. That is super, super, super soft. Oh yeah, look <laughs> oh, at that. Oh. oh yeah. That is top tier, that's a good donut. It's mm. much better than the one I had. Where did I have, oh, have that other one? It had nothing in it. Oh, it was from our New York, New York hotel in Vegas. Chin me off. Cause it said Nutella in it, didn't have any Nutella no. on it or in it whatsoever. That's an incredible donut for $2.70. Okay. So you recommend donut prints, do you? Yeah. <laughs> I like donut prints. I like. Never, never heard of it before in my life of you, but. But Colby Bryant's been here. Yeah, so it must be. Maybe it's yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe but it's... that's her. That's her. who's just saved me. Who? The lady in the picture. Is it? Yeah. Anyway. That's incredible. I also just noticed behind you there's McDonald's. It's got a play area. When do you ever see that these days? I think they got rid of all our play areas yeah. in the UK. Because bloody kids are trashy it. Yeah, true. Right, so. Onwards. Great success at Donut Prince. <laughs> great success. Okay, so donut's been eaten. I mean, it took him two seconds. Oh, barely. You guys know how fast he eats. And we're now on route to a special filming location, guys. So we're not going to tell you what it is. We want you to guess in the comments. We will show you. 
when we get there. It was half an hour away, right, from where we just were. Yes. We've got 11 minutes to go at this point. Um, Clue-wise, it's one of my favourite films. So. Yeah, if they know you, it's yeah. pretty easy. To, Viv and Cars, don't cheat. If you're called Viv and Cars, you're not allowed. If you're called VKHL Adventures, should I say, because we might have a Viv or Cars who actually watch us oh, as that's well. that's true. Um, if you're VKHL Adventures, you're not allowed to comment on this because you guys have been here. You are our influencers for this. And I, it was on, it's on, been on the list for ages, hasn't it? For yeah, no. Nope. We'll, sh- we'll show you the location first before we tell you what it is, so you got well, a chance to guess. Maybe we'll tell you in next week's vlog. Who knows? So you can't cheat. No. <laughs> no, you know what? I'm not going to tell you when we tell you. Just write it in the comments, otherwise you're all just going to go cheat, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> and we want actual real answers here, guys. So. She's so serious about this. <laughs> it's a little game in it in the comments. So. In the next clip, you'll see the filming location when we get there. Ten minutes to go for us, one second for you. Here we are, guys. We're at the filming location. Any guesses? Put your guesses in the comments and we'll let you know at some point what it is and we can see if you're right or not. Oh, it's so nice there to it see is. it. It didn't take half an hour either. It took about 20 minutes from where we just were. Yeah, yeah, we got here. So it wasn't go. a really long, you know, detour to come and see it, but there it is. If how, you know, you know. How weird's that to see it in real life? Yeah, it's sick actually. Wow. It looks a lot different in real life now I than it did. I want to live there. Yeah. So guys, we've just arrived at Echo Park Lake now, where we're gonna do some pedal Swan Lake boat ride thing. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. We saw Vivian Cars do this on their vlog. We thought we really want to do that. Influenced again by Vivian Cars. I feel yeah. like we've copied them at this point today, but it looks insane. It looks stunning. We've come at sunset as well, so it looks. This is what I wanted to do. I put it yeah. like late at night on the ice because so I was like, I want to do it when the sun's setting, and because the the swans light up. I don't know if you can really see at the minute. But they are lit up. But they are lit up. And look how cute it is at sunset. Yeah, no, we don't know the price. We'll tell you the no, price now. We'll let no you know clue. whether you need a card or whether you can do tap, 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 and tap. Hopefully it's not just cash only, but I doubt it, to be fair. It looks like a proper, like, building. Yeah. Oh, God, there's a goose coming at us. So, it's $12 per adult. Oh, we're definitely oh, doing this. Oh, you get this. an hour. That's oh, cool. Fantastic. And you, it looks like you can tap, and tap, so that's good. Right, should we do it loose? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> so you do actually have to book it online. Um, there's a QR code. And then obviously once you do that, it will check you in. So hopefully it only takes like two seconds. But $12 for an hour per person? I said that's decent. Mm. They look incredible. Although you get an hour, that's long yeah, as well, isn't it? We're going to be knackered, aren't we? It's pedal bots. <laughs> we are on. <laughs> we have made it. We're on, guys. Oh. But they don't steer very well, okay? No, um, there's a lot of flies hanging around, so I think I might be getting bit <laughs> to pieces. This is really nice, though. We've got our legs out. So, I'm staring so, here. Oh yeah, guys, I'm not showing you my bruise. Look at this. It's This is this doesn't look as bad, does it, to be fair? No. It was a, a lot worse. I um, need a bin, as you do, so top tip, don't go around kneeing bins. 
you're left with this. Anyway, oh no, I'm getting wet. Oh this no. Is blowing, <laughs> this is blowing spray at me. Oh, look at that. So you could just, in the, in the distance, you can just make it out. Look at I've the views, robbed that guys. Building. I've robbed that building so in many GTA times. In GTA is on about, not in real life, guys. Oh, Disclaimer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Which I, one? The Pepsi one? No, the one on the left. It looks a bit like a, All right. a, a Robert Downey Jr.'s Iron Man's heart on the top. All right, nice. Uh, but yeah, if you go too close to this, because it's windy, it's blowing spray. So in true Steve form, he's driving me into it, isn't he? I would never. But yeah, guys, this is really good. It's going to be a workout, I think. Oh, yeah. But look how pretty this one's all lit up. Look, here's our swan. She's called Sheila. Sheila. Trailer. Sheila the swan. Trailer. This is very peaceful. Do you know what though? 12, oh no, we're gonna crash. Twelve dollars. I mean, I said that's that's pretty decent for an hour. Hmm. You it's, need to stir. It's somewhat different from like the wild city life that is LA. Yeah. Nice, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. Oh hi. Hi there. Look how romantic we are. Oh. Aren't you a lucky lady? I don't think I'll last an hour on this. She's knackered already. We've been going for about Please. five minutes. <laughs> and it's the flies. <laughs> There's loads of flies, guys, and they're biting me. She's, not, she's just not enjoying the peacefulness. That is the swan. Sheila. Ah! No, I hate the flies. Why is there loads of them? Because we're on the water. Oh. Can any of you guess this song, ready? Since we are on the water. Oh, the posh, posh, the travelling life, the travelling life for me. First captain, captain, same regal company. Whenever I'm bored, I travel abroad ever so properly. Pull out, starboard, posh, with a capital P O S H, posh. Name the film. Um, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Oh, find me, mate. Well done. <laughs> Tell you how, darling. This is how it should be. Lads, sit at the back. With the legs up. This well, is really hard. <laughs> Little Miss Princess Lucy pedals for her life. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Do you want to swap? Yeah. Okay, let's swap. Can I sit there? Yeah, of course you can. Come on then. <laughs> Come on. Summer's gone, I'm latching on Don't even know your name But you're still in my head Underneath, rays of gold Your body, you're so close No, I can't forget, no When I saw you on the dance floor I was to you who saw me first I guess it's history now and I shouldn't care but it still hurts I didn't realize the danger Cause you're the end of the rainbow And the music was so loud Didn't catch your name over this crowd So we've just got off the swan bolts. We came off a little bit early because there was lots and lots of like mosquito midges. They were massive. They were like the biggest mosquitoes I've ever seen. There was loads. I think they were attracted to the light on the swan. I think so. Oh, I no. think so. So we it thought, for me. you know what? Let's get off with enjoy now for half an what? hour. Uh, we did half an hour. So yeah. we did half of what? We could have had. Hour, yeah. I don't think I could have lasted another. I'm still, I'm like itching I everywhere. Could, I could tell you she was uncomfortable. And I was like, you know what? Let's <laughs> yeah. just get off and get some ice cream. Uh, I didn't like, like, it was great. I just, like, I don't know even if like, I had pants on, because my legs are out, and I was thinking I'm gonna be a bit, like, if I had pants on, would it have been better? But I don't know, because we were like, around my, I felt like it was like on my yeah, face. Yeah, there was and, a lot. Like, 
There but was a lot. There is a better option. So I said, we'll just get off and we'll go grab some ice cream. Now, we found a place called Fluffy McClouds. Now, I have never heard of it. <laughs> no idea what it is, but it is a seven minute walk away from these uh, swan boats. So we'll head over, see what they sell, and then get some ice cream. Yeah, I could do with a little uh, snack. Yeah, me too. So we have found it. Oh, it's a nice little shop. Hey, Fluffies. Okay, so for the first time ever, we've decided to get a sundae to share because Guys, it comes... sharing with me. It comes with four scoops, so we decided, you know what the hell? It's quite late at night, let's get one to share. So we went for chocolate, pistachio, cookies and cream, and what was the last one? Banoffee, Banoffee pie. pie. And it came with hot fudge, nuts, two pretzel sticks, and we took the cherry because... Ugh. And we took the whipped cream off. Cause... Yeah, because you don't like it, do you? No. Shall we give it a try? So I'm looking forward to trying the banoffee pie. That's the banoffee one. Is it good? <laughs> oh yeah. Wow. Oh, that is so good. Is it? It's really, really banana -y. Oh, oh, oh. You'll love that. What's the hot fudge like? I don't know, right? I'm gonna try it with whatever this ice cream is here. <laughs> wow, look I've at got, that. I've so got it all. Sloppy right, hot fudge. Is that good? <laughs> yeah. It's a very uh, peaceful vibe in here. Mm. I like the, um, was it pecans? Yeah. That's on top. They're really nice. I'm excited for this. Mmm. Oh Which God. one did you have? That is amazing. Have you oh tried the banoffee one yet? Yeah, that's it. That, that, those pecans. In it. And that hot fudge sauce. Mm-hmm. Oh my <laughs> God. At this point, Luce, we may need to get another. <laughs> no, don't do this to me. We're sharing. Um, 10 out of 10. That's amazing. And it came to... $15. 15 something yeah. with tax added on. And they have free water in here, guys. It and it's really nice, actually, isn't it? Yeah, I've got a cup. It's really good water and it's ice cold as well. Mm. That's amazing. It's really cute in here, isn't it? I love the vibe. Yeah, me too. Right, mm. please share. I've paid for this, technically it's all mine. Just finish up the ice cream now. It was, I'll tell you what, for, for a small little find and a small little shop, that was amazing ice cream. I could have probably eaten a sundae on my own to be fair. Easily. He said, oh yeah, it's to share like four people, like a normal standard um, portion is two. two scoops and the sundae was four. So it was like a final share, I think it was this massive thing and it really was. Easily, I've had it. But you know what? It was a nice, comfortable amount of ice cream for this time of night. Um, and yeah. like I said, for a small little find, everything that they make, in the ice cream shop, it's all in-house. So your hot fudge, your, your uh, ice cream's all made within that shop. And you know what? I could tell because I've never tasted anything like that. Yeah, it, it like was it was really nice. completely different to like Ghirardelli and Cold Stone and things like that. I think I, I wish they just had more hot fudge in it. Yeah, you and could have asked like for that, you know. Peanut butter. Oh. I keep saying this, don't I? Every no, Sunday yeah. I want hot fudge and peanut butter. But honestly, the combo together. The only time we've ever had the combo together yeah. is the All American Sunday, innit? And that's on, on yeah, that's on Main Street in Magic Kingdom in Florida yes. yeah but you know what that was amazing mm -hmm. so um, all we're gonna do now is gonna head back to the car which is obviously literally outside of the Near lake the lake yeah, yeah. It's so parked. the time is nearly nine o'clock now yeah. so it's an early-ish one for us we still gotta get but back we still now. gotta get back get back to the car which is what 15 15 minutes yeah. walk now and then obviously drive, drive back, back. To the hotel. so it's obviously gonna be still late yeah it'll be around about 10 p.m by the time we get home uh, but you know That'd what nice. i don't know how long this vlog's gonna be because obviously there's a, a huge portion of this day where we weren't allowed to film but yeah. it has been one of the most incredible days we've had it was unbelievable to actually go there and to actually see his office and actually see where it all started because really that is where it all started and um yeah, it no. was just, um, no words, no words, it was amazing, absolutely I, amazing. Yeah, I still don't have words for it, to be quite honest I know. with you. Like, and not only that, the hike to the Hollywood sign, that was again surreal because we were so close to it. I forgot we did that too. Yeah. It was like ages ago, that, didn't I it? I know. But yeah, we, like, we got close, like, I've never been that close. Yeah, 
So even that, that was surreal. And then obviously the food, we had some good food today. We tried new things today, uh, random little local ice cream stores I've today. I've decided though that Kiki's is still the best French toast I've ever had. Oh, for like, sure. this one didn't, was it called BB's? Uh, BB's, I think it was, BB's. yeah. <laughs> but Kiki's. But Kiki's beats BB's. Yeah, if you're in Florida, check it out the, yeah. the food's amazing at kiki's i don't think they, had a, they don't have a kiki's don't here so. i don't think so because i did i think i googled it but no i know but you know what surreal day one of the best days we've ever done uh we got some amazing pins and some amazing merch yeah. from the store yeah that was really i loved seeing that yeah just being on the cat the whole campus like yeah insane incredible we've done so, a lot. Even, i was gonna say even the swan boats like they did make me feel uncomfortable but like the view from there i could see she was just like and I'm like, do you want to guess? She's going, I'm all right. <laughs> so I was like, let's just get off. There's no point in being uncomfortable. Let's just get off. We've done enough. My legs are sore. You made me pedal. Yeah, if people know me, they know I don't like flies yeah. and like insects. And there was like a spider in the corner I spotted. And I was like, I'm asked to jump in but in a minute. Like, it's... Do you know what? That half an hour was nice. We did I'm half glad an hour. we did it. We did half an hour. We could have done 10 minutes, but I, I powered through. You powered then through. it got to half an hour and I was like, I don't think I can do anymore. Yeah, it was great. She so was like, let's just head back. I just thought, even it was still good, it was just... I just thought, let's get off and get some ice cream, innit? Because I'm hungry. Yeah, but I was like, I, will, I am happy with that, me. I'll happily get some ice cream. Yeah, but no, we are going to head back, so we may as well end this vlog here. It's been an amazing day, so thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much. Please do like and subscribe. And leave a comment. If you have enjoyed the video. <laughs> have a wonderful evening, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Echo Park, Echo Lake Park. Yeah. Echo Park Lake. I want the world. I want the whole world. I want to lock it all up in my pocket. It's my bar of chocolate. And what did that? <laughs> what are you on about? What? Are you videoing me? Oh. It was Willy Wonka. I want the world. I own the whole world. I'm getting bit on my legs and it's itchy. It's my leg, don't bit me. Get off of me now. I am Voldemort. I'll have had a cadaver you. I will have zap you right off of this planet. I'll show you my wand. Get off me now. It was peaceful until this moment. To this idiot get on a swan. Top tip, don't go around kneeing bins. Look what I have just found on the street. Now, listen, if you all remember our Orlando day. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. Uh -huh. eh? King of the castle, king of the castle. Don't do that. This does not belong to me. It's just on the streets of LA. Oh no, that's so random. <laughs> it's going to be full of germs, get off. Oh, I don't like. I'll put it back. <laughs> Amazing. Great find. <laughs> <laughs>